Ghana against Russia. I'm Peter Drury and this is Jim Beglin. Thanks Peter, it's a pleasure and a privilege for me to be here. And that gets things running. Hoists it high. And the finish! He's done very well to get to that. Oh, much more than a, than a routine save for me and, and yet he just coped with, with room to spare. To foul. Yep, referee's given it. There could be trouble here. But for now, the referee is keeping his cards in his pocket. And he's going direct. Can he finish? It's there! Unbelievable. Listen, scoring early doesn't guarantee you anything, but the first goal was always important, and that's a terrific opening. Oh, a goal of real quality. He made it look ridiculously easy. Look, volleys can be worked on and improvements can be made, but in the moment, it takes timing and balance to catch the perfect spot on the ball to produce brilliance like that. That is absolutely magnificent. Ghana, go ahead, one goal to the good. Away from immediate danger. It's gone out for a throw-in. Dinks one in. forward and he's made sure that that won't get through tries to get it forward quickly forward it goes looks to bypass the midfield Now the pass. Goes direct to the front line. Referee's given a throw. Good challenge, he just stood firm. That's another throw. So what now? It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Plays it out to the wing. Pumps it into the area. Gets up to head it! Boots it to safety. Thrust towards the front line. Ghana scoring in the first 10 minutes to give them a 1-0 lead. Danger averted for now. It'll be a throw in.
Swiss it out of harm's way. And the defence can get it clear. And the referee's had a look, and he's blown his whistle for half-time. Well, you obviously have to give credit to the front men for the half-time lead, but I think the midfield can really pat themselves on the back too. They work tirelessly for me. Garner head for the dressing room in possession of a 1-0 lead. Well, 1-0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. With a delicate ball. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Well, he simply failed to just put a little more oomph behind that. He goes long. Now here's the through ball. Oh, good interception. Tried to play it through. Yeah, and the vision to get him through was all good, but the execution of the pass wasn't quite right. But importantly, he's holding his line until the very last moment. And that will pay off. This defence is, is weary about opposition pace. So they're just not getting too tight? Yeah, they know that if they, they step up, their, their keeper could get a whole lot busier. Played out to the wing. Has gone out. There is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. it away here comes another cross he was well picked out just needed a better finish well if only the caliber of the finish was as high as the the caliber of the supply I mean that was a beautifully played cross and really should have seen something better on the end of it there's going to be a change here there's a man waiting to come on Lobs it in gently. Is that a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Well, that's a booking. Always looked it. One option. Goes long and forward. Decent ball. Garner leading here by this still precarious 1-0 margin. Aimed long and direct. Looks like a good ball through. Just a few more moments for them to hang on. And the referee brings it to a close. Ghana win it by the only goal. Result, no question, the most important thing, however...